happy new year happy 2021 we have made it out of 2020 alive and well and kicking and god is so good so happy new year to you and i'm so happy to be back so let me explain <laughs> let me explain my absence okay so december came guys i was in like okay vlogmas 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 so focused vlogmas i was happy excited and then i was like you know what hold up like i have to spend the whole of my december recording footage like i I'm, I'm, i believe in being present and for me that thing is just so hard and honestly i haven't reached that point in vlogging yet where i feel like i can be in a group of people and i'm just recording like i feel so shy so i couldn't imagine spending the whole of december with my phone like this i was just like no no chance <laughs> but i tried i tried on the 2nd of february of december i think it was the second um and then i deleted the footage just like this one word but i was like you know what anyway it's good to take a little short break and come back ready and you know for all the content and all the goodness that comes in 2021 so here i am okay that was it sorry without further ado let's get right into <laughs> into this live update okay the first one is that i I'm engaged guys like god is so good <laughs> i feel this is i'm so awkward about it i'm learning <laughs> but i got engaged and that was in december on the 30th of december and it was really sweet it was really nice i'm gonna do a story time on the engagement and probably like in one of these videos in january i'm gonna do a story time so don't worry i'll tell you the story i think you've heard his voice in the boyfriend does my voiceover video so that's his voice <laughs> his face will be coming guys i've been begging i've been trying but he's been refusing so lord willing yes <laughs> so lord willing one of these days when you know i don't know what we need to do to bring him but yeah we'll try our best to bring him over but yes he brought plates, Lobola, if anyone may not be familiar with um, Bemba. I think Lobola is Bemba. So he brought plates in October of last year and we he, he proposed like the, you know, that proposal on the knee. I'm going to insert some cute little pictures. You know, it was a really sweet proposal. And I'm going to tell you the story time on that one in one of my videos. And then would love to get married on the 13th of february there's a lot of uncertainty with covid and all that because as you know the cases have been escalating but we are trusting in the lord and we are trying to be open-minded hard for a bride but trying to be open-minded i think weddings are a little more personal to the bride than the groom most times but you know sometimes it's different it's not a one-size-fits-all thing but trying to be open-minded the fact that the wedding might look different but at the end of the day happy to be getting married the second update is the fact that i registered crown your main guys like it's registered with kakra it's a fully functioning business <laughs> ah, that day i can't explain the excitement that i felt at first kakra gave me a run for my money guys i was submitting they were rejected so i said you know what it's not possible that crown your main is registered in zambia so Thank God someone at Pakra um, was able to process it well. Like I had to go and just be a sweet little girl and be like, guys, listen, like I know this name is not in the system. What's the problem? And you know, a very lovely man was helpful and I'm so grateful to God. It was such a good day, guys. I felt like this thing that I just started in 2019, like out of the blue, like it was just something random. It was so nice to have the name crown your main registered and at first they're like no you need to change it but i was just like i i don't know what i can name it i could have done the trade as thing but i was like i don't know guys crown your main is really personal to me so i finally went there in person and i got it so it's registered and the reason why i was trying to register crown your main is because lord willing i'd love to open a salon um in the first six months let me say the first six months i would open it tomorrow if i could but unfortunately oh, okay so let me explain let me get backtrack a little bit i was hoping to open i was hoping i was hoping to open on the 4th of january like when the year begins but unfortunately i was being a little ambitious with preparing for a wedding preparing for a home and then adding a salon to that was gonna be a bit tricky realistically like the the week of the week before the fourth guys i was just so stressed i don't know what was going on like it wasn't really working so i was hoping to open on the 11th 
but then my mom was like, okay, okay, like being for real, yeah, taking on too many projects, so perhaps you wait. And then obviously with the wedding, two weeks would have been a bit tricky. I was going to open in February, but that's been ambitious because I really want to be a part of it, like really hands on with what's going on. So I couldn't open and just up and leave. So we decided that it will open Lord willing March, but I'm not really sure because of COVID. I'm not really sure if that's going to work out. I don't know what the future holds, but preparations are underway. And if you'd like for me to take you on the, like to vlog the experience, I can vlog that. That's fine because I'll be in the comfort of the salon room. So I'm okay with vlogging. Um, so if you'd like me to take you on that journey, I'm more than happy to do so. So just comment down below. I also think I would love to share the journey because I think when we see businesses start, we just have this, like it's just started. Like, you know, you don't even know what went into it. And this business just like mushrooms into something amazing. Like you don't even know what went into it in the preparations, the stress of everything. So I'm glad to be your guinea pig, you guys. If I fail, we fail together. <laughs> if I succeed, we succeed together because you guys have been such a big part of it all this time. So those are the three updates that I had for you. As for YouTube, I have such amazing content. I'm so excited for 2021 with regards to content. I have so much up my sleeves. I think, I guess in that sense, December worked out really well. So if you'd like to be a part of it, subscribe, you guys. Oh, we are on the way to 5K. You guys are so amazing. You know, I was off youtube for a month but i could still see like subscriptions were going up going up so i'm so grateful and i'll see you in the next video if you have any questions and if you'd like to i don't know guys i just you know um comment whatever down below i don't know what you'll comment <laughs> or comment if you'd like me to take you on the hair journey but yeah other than that you guys thank you so much for being a part of 2020 like you guys have made um youtube in 2020 really easy to do and amazing and exciting thank you for all the support and thank you to each and every one of you who dm me like excuse me it's been a week excuse me Mwape, we miss you where's our video you guys were like so sweet and i'm so grateful that was really nice it actually pushed me like Mwape, you can't just be chilling you know <laughs> so yeah please take care have an amazing day and i'll see you in the next video bye